Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and to answer a question that probably puzzles a lot of people and it has to do with shutdown and restart not having the same speed. So if you use your PC and you shut it down, you might have noticed that the shutdown is and of course when you click that power button to restart is actually faster than using the restart option within the menu here. And so a lot of people are wondering if that's normal and it is. And the explanation comes from um, a very interesting change that Microsoft did in Windows and that started in Windows 8. So for most people, you might notice that when you start your PC after you shut it down, it actually comes on quite fast. And you might be thinking, wow, you know, Windows must be smaller than it was, or, you know, the boot up is so fast compared to Windows 7. Well, it doesn't have anything to do with that. It has something to do with the fact that shutdown is not a total shutdown. When you actually choose the shutdown option, you might think, well, you know, it's the shutdown that powers off the PC completely. In reality, it's kind of a mix between a shutdown and an hibernate mode. And there are some files that are actually saved to your hard drive that are, uh, for example, the Windows kernel. And what that does is that when you actually start your PC, because that is already there and it's already there to pick up to make it run immediately, it seems like you're actually booting up real fast on your PC. Well, that is the reason your restart is long because restart actually does a real complete shutdown before it actually restarts and does not save files on the hard drive. So that means that on the shutdown part of the restart, it's the same, but on the restart, when you actually boot up, now, because it doesn't have files that are ready for the Windows operating system, it has to actually reload in memory all of the Windows kernel as if, you know, the computer didn't have any information before. So an actual restart actually does more of a restart than the shutdown does. And actually, um, when you read several posts of people having issues, one of them that I came across a few times was the fact that if you have a problem when you're running Windows, one of the tips that is given sometimes is to actually click the restart option rather than the shutdown option. And that reason is it actually wipes away anything that Windows is keeping and restarts from scratch the session in Windows, which means if that file that was written to your hard drive has some glitch that is causing your computer to have issues, well, maybe that will be fixed with a restart. So it's kind of weird, but this started in Windows 8 because they wanted to have a way for your computer to boot up faster. One of the biggest complaints of Windows for ages was how long it took for a computer to actually boot up. And that's why a lot of people actually chose to sleep mode instead of a shutdown because they just didn't want to wait, you know, for Windows to boot up all the time. So that is the reason for the speed change. Shutdown saves files that are actually picked up when you start up to boot things faster. Well, restart actually completely dumps everything and needs to restart the whole operating system when you actually restart and that's why it's much longer and also like i said if you got issues sometimes a restart might actually be a cure for a problem if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching